Hey there peeps, it's me again and I'm back for another video. This time, I am going to share how we use the Binance P2P. So if you really want to learn more about it, I suggest that you should watch this video until the end. Okay guys, so I will be showing to you the basics on how are we going to use the Binance P2P. Right here in the wallet section, okay? So you can see the P2P right here, okay? So this is just the basics. So I am going to click P2P. Okay, so assuming that I want to buy some USDT. So first I have to click buy. And then a new tab will open. So since I'm based from the Philippines, let's change this to php so you can see the merchants right here guys okay and you can see the prices that they made in the available and of course um, their payment options okay so let's say i want to use gcash so i am going to go right here for payment and i just click this option so guys pay attention to the limit so this guy right here has a limit of 1999 up to 32,596.41 as of this time in recording this video and also you could see uh, his orders all right however guys we want to test deposit a small amount so let's say i want to go for zal exchange so i want to check his profile first okay so you could see the advertiser details okay the security deposit the total orders the completion rate is 100 percent so that's good and the latest transactions okay so what i am going to do guys is that i will be buying some usdt so i will test deposit 500 pesos so you could see right here guys that payment time limit is 15 minutes okay and you could see his available balance so let's say i want to pay 500 pesos so i will receive 9.92 usdt so once i'm going to do that i will be clicking buy usdt so you can see right here guys um this is the chat box so i want to make sure if this person is online so we have to wait and you could see the details right here so i don't want to proceed if this person hasn't replied so for now guys of course there is a 15 minute limit all right so please make a payment within 15 minutes otherwise the order will be cancelled and make sure that you read these tips as well okay so this person is online, so let's proceed with the payment since this person has replied. So I'm going to copy this number and I'm going to open my Gcash account right here on the Bluestacks Android emulator. So what I'm going to do is that I will be sending the money and then click Express Send. And then I will be entering the mobile number of that person. And then I enter the exact amount. Just leave this, okay? I click Next and then verify the details and then send once it's done all you have to do is to print screen your receipt so it says right here payment received thanks so i think this person doesn't need a screenshot so i click transfer and then i click confirm however if he or she still needs the screenshot of your receipt of course you just have to upload it right here so there we go guys your payment has been received the asset usdt have been sent to your account to verify it guys of course let's go to the wallet and go to p2p so i am going to show it and there we go guys it has reflected to my p2p account so let's say if i want to trade it first we have to transfer so to do that i click the transfer button and then from p2p to fiat and spot so i click max and then i click confirm transfer is successful so we go to the wallet and go to this section fiat and spot and there you go guys, my USDT has reflected from the P2P balance to the fiat and spot balance. So I would like to remind you guys that if that seller needs the screenshot of your receipt, whether if it's a bank account, Gcash, or any other provider out there, of course, please do so. Because what I have dealt with that person, she quickly said that she received the payment, so there's no need for me to send screenshot. However, if that person still needs your screenshot as proof of payment, of course, just do it. Upload your screenshot of the receipt. 
So guys, I have a question for you. What do you honestly think about my basic tutorial in using the Binance P2P? Especially if you are from the Philippines. Do let me know your honest thoughts, reactions, or opinions by just leaving down your comments right here on the video. At least I have shared to you about the basics of Binance P2P. I hope that you've learned something from me in this video. Thank you all for watching, by the way. Kindly don't hesitate or think twice in sharing this to your crypto, blockchain, DeFi, NFT, and blockchain gamers out there. And I would like to invite you all to smash the like button, hit subscribe, and turn on the notification bell for you to stay notified about my latest videos regarding cryptocurrencies blockchain technology decentralized finance nfts and blockchain games and you can follow my social media channels right here or in my youtube description okay guys so from my freaking home studio this is jeff aka nomad fury and see you all on my next video